All right, what is up, YouTube? Yeah, sorry for the messed up schedule this week. Um, I was going to record earlier today, but then the ban list or the adjustment, as Konami would like to put it, came out in, yeah, so you see how, you know, kind of took pretty much precedence over whatever I had going for myself at the time. So, yes, I'm pretty sure everybody, I mean, this is going to be going up on Thursday, so, you know, it should be, you know, public knowledge right now that uh what konami hit but if you know if you did not know um i believe juggler plus fire potomus is banned monkey board luster and joker is at one and then the errata of um sorcerer pretty much made it like the ocg effect so yeah that's nothing new but um what i've been pretty much seeing everywhere is people saying that the deck is dead um as much i would like for the deck to be dead i really don't see how the deck is dead. like i've seen a whole bunch of people cutting already cutting the perform agent and so i mean that's not nothing really new to their deck we still have to deal with three waver knives we still have to three with three draco face off i mean yes we don't have to deal with infinity and the constant stratoses but i mean they still have all the tools to make the deck go and you know it's not like the deck is just completely all i see people put up oh pepe is dead konami killed pepe rip pepe pepe all this stuff and it's like you know all they they did hit they did hit some cards but it's like it's not really like i i just don't believe that the deck is dead you know that's just me i just i've seen people win without the perform eight engine like Luster going to one doesn't really do anything. Yes, they don't open it up as much, but still, they still are. They still have instead of having seven copies in their deck, they only have four, because Draco Faceoff gets them the Luster. So it's not like they have a problem getting to Luster or anything like that. So, I mean, like I said, it's just a step in the right direction. Um, I did not see Konami doing this at all. I always wanted Monkey Board to go to one. Now I don't know about Joker, but. Monkey board, I, I believe that that card should have went to one because it's like there's no really restriction on that card. Like you can special summon, you can do whatever you want, and you know you can still activate monkey board. And it's like it's, it's a free scale. Um, I don't pretty sure they didn't intend to really do that. So I mean that's the only card I really seen them hitting, but you know I really didn't believe they were gonna hit that either. So this is just. Why it is surprising, I just don't see the deck as being gone, forever gone. As much as I would like it to be, the pendulum mechanic is going to keep that deck around for I don't even know how many months to come. And then in May, we're getting the Dr Draco Overlords, or however you say it, the Draco Overlords or some shit like that. Like, we're, they're still going to be like, they're going to just come right back. So, I mean, yeah, this this is good. You know, it's a step, like I said, it's a step in the right direction. But, you know, as far as I see it, Pepe is not dead at all. Like, I think now we're going to just start seeing Ariande builds. Like, I don't want to play against that. I would rather play against regular Pepe um, than Ariande. And then don't forget, they still have Sorcerer. They can still pop two and search two. Like, it's, it's, they still have all these cards. They have a pot of Greed built in with Lizard Draw and Gee Turtle. Like, they still have all of the tools for success. They just... You know, now they just cut out cards that people already didn't like. Like, they did not like to perform it in, like, toward a later, later on, like, I guess recently, a lot of people was cutting the perform agent in because it just, it really just messes up your hands. Like, if you got a monkey board, the perform agent will still keep it at, I mean, make it a four. So, you know, a lot of people just didn't want to deal with that. So, they was cutting that. So, I mean, like I said, man, congrats to Konami for actually doing something put an advancement whatever the case may be but i just i just don't i really don't see anything really stopping the deck from doing what it's usually doing so i mean i guess that's my little too since you guys let me know what you guys think do you think the deck is dead do you think you know they can still do or do what do you think do you think like me where like it's really not it's really not as dead as people are saying it to be like i, I just really believe that deck is just still going to function the way it is it's just going to be a little slower like i mean but that's what not but anyway so that's my little two cents on that and what the case may be but anyways yeah so right here you, you guys are just basically seeing some replays i've collected over like i guess the past 
week or two weeks or something like that. Yeah, I think the latest one is probably on the 21st. So, yeah, probably the last week is the, um, these are the duels. I've been, these are different decks. Um, you've seen the Light Sworn deck, I believe. Um, then you've seen, like, you're going to see a Jewels of the Var Valiant in this one, one of these decks. Like, I was just testing decks. You're going to see, you know, Mallies and stuff like that. So, I was just testing deck. You guys let me know. Like, I don't know what to play. I want to play the Light Sworn because I feel like, you know, that that could be a lot real good, like, with the Shira News. Because I'm really liking the Field Card a lot more. And I'm really hating Chief Freeze. And I'm pretty sure you guys already heard me talk about it. But I'm really hating Chief Freeze. And I really want to cut it out and just put, um... Probably two Bushies and two, um, what is it, Swords Smith? No, Spectral Swords. Two Spectral Swords and just, you know, just try to turbo it out. I don't know. But, yeah, like I said, here you go. Here's the um, Mali build I was playing with Jewels of the Valiant. You know, you guys did see this. Double Omega with a Unizombie still on board. Um, I mean, it's good. And this guy right here was just, I mean, yeah, like you, you see this man had Juggler. But, you know, it didn't really matter. But, like I said, I'm, I'm glad konami did hit juggler in all these cards because it was getting a little ridiculous no not a little it was getting a lot ridiculous i mean but damn like I, I just don't believe the deck is dead that's the only thing i don't believe um yeah so <laughs> you know yeah so i really don't like here it goes luster like you mean luster is cool they still like i said man I, I just don't believe the deck is done I believe we're going to see the deck some more and whatnot, and especially in May when Drake Overloads come out. It's going to get even more busted. They got a card that returns everything on the field to the deck. So, I mean, kudos to Konami. I'm like, I'm right now. I'm liking the adjustment thing. Well, we'll see if the deck is dead. I, hopefully, I'm wrong. Like I said, hopefully I am wrong. Hopefully the deck is dead. It just doesn't work. All inconsistent. All that junk and jazz. That would be fine for me because I wouldn't. I wouldn't keep give two shits about the deck not working but you know that's just really much what it is um yeah so we're closing in on this once again leave a comment like subscribe you know let me know your opinion let me know if you guys think agree with me what you think the deck is dead you know good riddance and all whatnot tell me what you think about konami's adjustment or i don't know it's just an emergency ban list i don't know why they don't say it and then also another thing i want to touch on a lot of people are selling everything like they, they konami said it in the damn video like i mean not in the video but konami said it in the text this might not even be on the the ban list that comes out these cards might not even be on the ban list so everybody's selling their shit ah, it's just it's just crazy times but yeah like comment subscribe click add to help support me in the channel let me know what deck you guys want me to play i'm leaning toward light swarms pretty sure that's what i'm gonna play and yeah that's about it just let these duels finish out and i'm out